Last year, the Virgin auction of Brazilian Caterina Migliorini to a Japanese man for $780,000 made headlines around the world. Now, Australian filmmaker Justin Sicily, who helped orchestrate the auction, plans to create a reality TV series with more Virgin auctions. Joining us to discuss this is HuffPost crime and, appropriately, weird news reporter David Moy. This is a weird story, man. You've been covering this extensively. Can you tell us more about his plans? Well, uh, the plan was originally to find uh, two virgins, a male and a female, who would be willing to uh, sell their virginity online and, uh, to the highest bidder. And, uh, you know, he got a firestorm of publicity. And uh, even though some of it was negative, people thinking that he's somehow, uh, you know, uh, causing great scandal, a Kardashian-sized scandal, he uh, apparently he's had enough people who've seen the results in the publicity that have uh, had uh, been attended to the first two virgins, mainly the female virgin, that he's getting lots of emails from other women and men who want to lose their virginity for money. And so he's turning it into a reality series. The uh, first uh, series will debut uh, at a trade fair in uh, France in October, and then he's planning on... Uh, you know, uh, once he sells that and that airs, he's planning on making a, a part, at least a part two. And who knows, it could be, uh, you know, we could be getting as you know, it could be just like Survivor where they had 25 seasons. We'd have 25 seasons of, you know, Virgins Wanted. Oh, God. So he's finding virgins who are volunteering for this and men and women. Uh, this is interesting. Uh, Justin shared some interesting information with you about the gender breakdowns, though. Uh, it, I would imagine, I'm just guessing, that it's much easier to find women, female versions for this show than male versions. Is that fair to say? Uh, no. Actually, there are a lot of guys that want to lose their virginity, and the reason that they have to go to a show and try and auction it off on the Internet is that they lack the confidence to close the deal, whereas a lot of the women who are uh, you know, selling their virginity are telling him that they don't want to lose their virginity to another virgin. I mean, who wants to lose a virginity to another virgin unless you're 15? But uh, what, um, is there any part of this, I mean, I know it's been investigated, you know, allegations of sex trafficking uh, with the auction. I mean, I, I, it would seem to me that a TV show like this would just be open to uh, all sorts of uh, legal authorities and all sorts of legal intervention. I mean, this seems like a bad idea. Um, well, it, it depends on what you consider a bad idea. If a bad idea is, uh, according, this filmmaker is getting worldwide publicity for uh, that he wasn't really a name producer before. Now he's got a worldwide name and he's got a TV contract, and uh, uh, so he seems to be okay with it. It's the uh, other people. It, it's one of those things where um, you know people say this is tragic. I'm not going to watch it, but I, I think they're going to watch it anyway just to see how much of a train wreck it is. Now, uh, well, it, woman, it certainly will be a train wreck, but like you said, that's never stopped anyone on television from making now, a buck off of it. I want to thank you for spending some time with us wait, here. But, 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 oh, is it? Uh, I was Go gonna ahead. Say about the sex I want to finish your last thought. Now, I didn't mean to cut you off there. The sex trafficking issue was something raised by the Brazilian Attorney General uh, back uh, when the case, when she finally sold off, uh, when Caterina Migliorioni finally sold off her virginity for a reputed $780,000. She was a Brazilian citizen, and he thought about searching for uh, sex trafficking laws. That might have been a publicity effort on his part. Justin, I, is, I, he hasn't confirmed to me how he plans to get around that, but at one point he was talking to me about having the, two, having the, the deed done on a plane, that somehow that would circumvent any rules of sex. Well, imagine if people spent this much time and energy on something actually healthy or positive for the world. Anyway, it's great to well, see you as always, news, man. So I never do that. We